much. Uh, First Minister, with a public administration hat on, the committee explored with the Permanent Secretary recent criticism about the Scottish Government's approach to the recording of decisions responding to FOI requests, ministerial correspondence and written questions, and providing information to parliamentary committees and transparency over spending. How will you ensure that the Scottish Government enhances transparency, particularly of key policy decisions, to enable full and proper parliamentary scrutiny? First Minister. Well, I'll seek to uh, preside over a government that is, in what it does, as transparent as possible. And in terms of uh, recording and storing, recording decisions, storing information, does that to the standards that would be expected. And you have heard from the permanent secretary uh, his determination to ensure that those standards are met. Um, I'm also realistic enough to know that. Um, in the heat of political debate, uh, no matter how transparent I think the government is being, there will be people who think we're not being transparent enough. And on occasion, they will be right, and we will need to reflect on that and, and learn from it. Some, uh, without going into the detail, although it, it goes to, I'm sure, some of what I will be talking to Richard and his committee about in the not-too-distant future, it is as frustrating for me, believe it or not, as it is for others in Parliament, if... For example, we are not able to locate a particular piece of paper that evidences a, a decision and then later locate it. That's not in, in my interest that kind of makes uh, the life of ministers seeking to uh, navigate issues and, and defend policies harder. So this is the bit that perhaps uh, opposition members will have a wry kind of raising of an eyebrow to, but it is true. It is actually for a sensible government, and my government is sensible, um, for a sensible government, these things, transparency, good record keeping, being able to demonstrate at the basis on which decisions are taken, it's as much in the interest of the government as it is in the interest of those holding the government to account. So are we, ever, are we you know, ever going to get to a stage where we don't get some things wrong sometimes or that we're not subject to legitimate criticism? No, because you know, nobody is perfect. But are we absolutely determined to make sure that we are meeting the standards uh, expected then without a shadow of a doubt, yes.